Hello everyone, I'm Danielle from Snippets of Inspiration blog and in this video I'd like to talk about my cloth diaper favorites. I always enjoy the cloth diaper favorites videos that I see on YouTube because it gives me an idea of what moms out there really like and what's working for them and so I thought I would let you know what mine are so maybe it'll be a help to you. So the first question is what's my favorite brand? Um, my favorite brand of diaper um, probably would be the Happy Endings Company. Everything that they sell, or most everything that they sell, is all um, eco-friendly. It's um, it's not anything synthetic fibers. The insides of their diapers are um, bamboo and charcoal bamboo. I just really like them. Um, whenever I order from them, I get everything pretty quickly, and um, a little handwritten note comes along with it. I really appreciate that. This is my Happy Endings diaper that I have, um, and they. It's it's a smaller company, so it's not they're not always in stock with everything that they have. But um, I found this little pirate diaper, and I like this pirate diaper because the the uh, skull and crossbones they're not frowning. I don't like that whenever they're like uh, frowning and looking all scary. These are like smiling. I just thought that was so adorable. And I live um, near Tampa Bay, and so we have the Buccaneers um, football team, and then we've got you know all the pirate stuff that goes along in the bay. Um, so I just thought it was sort of cute and went along with, you know, what we sort of like. Okay, the next thing is my favorite diaper type. And I would have to say that this varies depending on the activity. If we're just, you know, bumming around the house, I don't really think that the diaper type matters a whole lot. I have a lot of pockets and I have a lot of all in twos, but I guess for around the house, I would say all in twos. They're easy. You don't have to stuff them. I really like that. But if we're going out, I would definitely say covers and prefolds. Because once you put, you know, three or four pocket diapers in your bag, then your whole diaper bag's filled up. And prefolds and covers are just a lot easier um, to sit in there, and they'll take as much room. Okay, next is my favorite pocket diaper, and I'm sort of coming away from cloth diaper or pocket diapers because I don't like to stuff them. But I've got Bum Genius and Kawaii, and I've got a Rarps. Um, I've got a lot, uh, but I guess uh, favorite pocket diaper, maybe a Bum Genius. I hate to go with the flow and say, oh, I love Bum Genius, like everybody else says. Nothing wrong with Bum Genius. But um, I guess I've got four Bum Geniuses and I never have a problem with them. So if I ever need an absolute secure diaper, I would, I would probably grab the Bum Genius one. Next is my favorite nighttime diaper. Oh, and this one is a big one for me. I have the Kawaii Goodnight Heavy Wetter diaper, and I use this every night for nighttime. I have three of these, and I use them every night because I know that they work. Um, I have a, I've done a review on this diaper, and I also got my nighttime solution, and it in there it tells you everything that I do and that I use, but I really like the Kawaii Goodnight Heavy Wetter, and I've tried lots, but this really works for us, and my son's a heavy wetter. Four months old at 20-ish pounds, this works. Um, next is my favorite babysitter diaper. We don't really have a lot of babysitters, but um, we go to church and ladies in the nursery, they babysit him. And I would say for that is anything with Velcro. Um, I have a lot of kawaii's and I like kawaii's, um, but the Velcro on kawaii's is pretty strong as opposed to Velcro on Bum Genius, which tends to give out. Um, but this is really strong. So it's just like this. This is like a minty, sea foamy green, but it's got a little cute little teddy bear on the back too. I just think this is so adorable. Um, so this is good. And then also for grandparents, whenever we take him to my parents' house to babysit, um, this is easy for them to deal with. Just anything really Velcro. Next is my favorite all-in-one. And my favorite all-in-one is the Ones and Twos diaper. I know that you don't hear about that brand a whole lot. I didn't, but I got this on a sale. I haven't done a review. All of these diapers I'm talking about, I've done a review on. Um, but this is the logo, Ones and Twos diaper, and it's an all-in-one. I don't like Velcro, but this Velcro is really strong, like one of the strongest Velcros I've had. And everything's in here. It takes a long time to dry, but I like it. It's really trim. Most all-in twos are like, ugh. Or all in ones are really big, big and bulky, but this one's good. I like this one. Next is my favorite all in two, and I am in love with these diapers. These are the Lullaby diapers, Lullaby baby diapers, and they're so soft. It's not like a scratchy uh, waterproof. This is a all in two, um, and it actually has a pocket in it too if you wanted to stuff it. But mm, 
really strong, <laughs> but it's an all in two and it's got bamboo inserts in it and you just snap them in. You can snap them in the front or you can snap them in the back and then there's two inserts and they snap together. I love this diaper. I love it because of the print. I mean, it's not that the cutest print that you've ever seen. Oh, I just think it's so pretty. It's, it's a circus, traveling circus print. I really like this all in two. This is my favorite all in two. And I got that off of, um, I think Dream Diapers or Mickey's Diapers or Kelly's Closet, I can't remember, but one of those. Next is my favorite pre-fold. This is the first pre-fold that I ever got. It was the Grovia pre-fold and it came in a pack of three for eight or nine dollars. And I started using these in my pocket diapers and these really work. They're great. I love these. I know that they'll last me a long time. I have since been experimenting with a couple different kinds of other pre-folds. Um, but I don't know if it's just because I haven't used them enough and so they're not reached their maximum absorbency, but this is absorbs way better. I've not tried Green Mountain. I know that those are like the best that you can get, but they're kind of expensive, so I haven't tried those, so I can't really compare it to that, which maybe you have already tried. But I can compare it to Nikki's diapers pre-fold, which are good, but again, I feel like these hold more, and then Imagine, but I haven't used them as much either, so maybe they haven't fluffed up enough to reach their full absorbency. But the Grovia, uh, this is a medium size. It's my, it's one of my favorites. I like that one a lot. Um, next is my favorite cover, and actually my son is wearing this cover right now, but it's a Nikki's diaper cover, and it's in a chevron print dreamsicle. It's like an orange. It's just so bright and, and just so pretty. I really like the print on that. It's just, it's just a lots of fun. But the reason that I like that cover is because whenever you open it up on the inside, it's got a flap on the back kind of flap on the front so when you lay the insert in it's not going anywhere and then it's got gussets on either side of the leg and with my son being 20 pounds at four months he's kind of a chunky baby and so this fits him it fits him really well it's he's on um, not the smallest setting but the second to the smallest setting so I feel like it will grow with him I don't know that I could fit it on a newborn but but that's okay I like the diaper Nikki's diaper cover and I got it for like nine dollars on a sale which is a really good deal Next is my favorite insert. Um, I guess my favorite insert would have to be um, the Thirsty's Cotton Hemp the insert, pre uh, the insert, and it's cotton and hemp, and it's trim. It's weighty. It's heavier than a microfiber or maybe a bamboo, um, but this is the large size, and I got this in a two-pack at Target, and I really like this because it holds so much moisture. I did an experiment the other day to see if um, two bamboos could hold as much as this one holds, and two bamboos still don't hold as much as this. I was really surprised because I thought, surely two, bam two bamboo inserts would, but it didn't. I like this because I know that anytime I stick this in a diaper, no problems, no leaks, and we can go for probably three or four hours with this. I always pair it with something else because hemp is um, slow absorber, so I'll put either a bamboo or a microfiber on top of it just so it'll absorb it quickly. But that's my favorite um, insert that I use. Uh, my next, oh, favorite wipe. Um, I really like cloth wipes. It just makes sense to use cloth wipes. And my best friend from college, Andrea, she made me cloth wipes. This is flannel on this side, flannel on this side, and then she just surged the edges, and this works fabulous. She made me, um, I don't know how many she made, but she made enough, but then I decided I wanted to make myself some more just so I wouldn't have to um, skimp on using wipes, and so I made some more. These have little duckies on them, and it's just flannel on both sides, and then I had a friend surge the outside. While I was making these, I decided to make some smaller ones for the... Um, for the travel uh, wipe case that I have. Sometimes whenever you're just doing tinkle and you're just wiping their bottoms, you know, you don't need a huge one like this. And this is, I think this is a six by six, or maybe it's an eight by eight. Yeah, I think it's an eight by eight square. And so this is just half of that. And these fit really nicely into the little case that I have. And whenever I'm doing just um, tinkle wipes, this is perfect size. And so I really like these. These are my favorites. My favorite wipe solution, is again it's just my own i just do um some hot water and some baby uh soap just shake it up and i use that and i squirt it on my wipes um and that's that's perfect so perfectly fine for us 
Next is my favorite rash cream. I don't have any rash cream per se. I use coconut oil. Um, I just got a huge jar of organic coconut oil and I scoop some out and put it in a smaller jar and that just stays on the diaper table and changing table. And then whenever he looks like he's getting a little bit red or with a little bit of a rash, I just put that on there and it clears up. So that's cheap and it's easy and that's what I use and it works well. My favorite wet bag is a Bumpkins wet bag. It's right here. I went through a couple different kinds of wet bags because i um, trying to experiment and see what I like. I just had, where did I get it from? I think it was a blueberry wet bag and there's nothing wrong with it, but I wanted something like this. See how this opens up and then you can just snap it. I can snap this onto my diaper bag and then I don't have to put it inside my diaper bag. And so all the stinky stuff stays outside. And I just got a chevron print just because I like chevron and it's neutral for a boy or girl. I've got a boy right now, but we'll have more kids later. And then it's just just a wet bag. This is what I use for traveling and on the go. I also have a large Planet Wise wet bag and I use that and it just stays in the bathroom. Um, we're living in a one room apartment, one bedroom apartment right now. So baby boy is in the living room on the far side of it. And so all of his stuff is sort of set up over there. And I don't have a diaper trash can um, that I would use. I think whenever we move into a house, which will be very soon, we will probably be getting a trash can with a liner. It just seems like it will be easier than carrying around this big, um, big bag of dirty diapers. Um, so anyway, that's but bumpkins is my favorite wet bag because the little handle unsnaps and you can snap it wherever you want it My favorite place to buy diapers. I, I I'm not loyal to just one site, but I buy all of them online um, I don't have a cloth diapering store in my town or really nearby So I buy everything online and I bought from jackbenatural.com and I get my kawaii diapers from there you can rack up points with them and um it's uh, free shipping on everything, so that's really good. And I have quite a bit of kawaii diapers. And then I go to Kelly's Closet for other things that I may need that maybe Jack B. Natural doesn't have. And then I also use Nikki's Diapers. I like Nikki's Diapers brand, and they have some other brands of diapers that Kelly's Closet does not have. And so those are the three main ones that I use whenever I do buy something for cloth diapering. My favorite closure is definitely Snaps. Um, I didn't cloth diaper baby boy when he was a newborn. We just had so many disposables that we had gotten from our baby shower, which was wonderful to have. And I just used up those and then we started cloth diapering, but I would use, I would do Snaps. It's harder to get a good fit, I suppose. And it's harder on hubby because it's easier to get a good fit when you've got Velcro, but I like Snaps because I think they hold up better. Even with the Velcro that I have, they're already starting to deteriorate a little bit and I don't think they would last for two or three years. Favorite storage space for my cloth diapers. Okay, I have a um, changing table that my dad actually built me, and so I was able to design it and let him know how I wanted everything. And so I decided that I wanted a drawer at the top, which is wonderful. I can keep all of my little um, supplies in there. And then there's two shelves. And on those two shelves, I have these really um, big uh, containers. They're just like fabric on the outside and on the inside, and then you can pull it out by this. And I just put all of my diapers in these. And I've got three on the bottom and a couple on the bottom, or three on the three in the top shelf and then a couple on the bottom shelf. And then each one is just different kinds of diapers that I use. And this works really well for us. I feel like with a drawer, I you have to open the whole drawer and then if it's weighted down the drawer, it might mess up the mechanics and engineering of the drawer. I know maybe I'm overthinking this, but I just thought it'd be easier just to have these little, um, little cubby um, storage boxes. And I really like that, that I've got going there. And then my favorite detergent would be the Tide Original Powder. Whenever I first began cloth diapering, I had lots of other mommy friends who were already cloth diapering and I got uh, recommendations from them. And one of my girlfriends, um, Andrea again, um, she said that she used just Tide Original and that I believe it was Rumper Roos. They had done an um, experiment, a study done on what is the best cloth diapering detergent to use. And they even said that Tide was one of the best instead of, and so instead of using Rumper Roos, maybe own um, detergent they said you can use Tide so I've been using Tide original powder this whole time and I never had any problems with it and I like that I can get Tide just right here in my town I don't have to order off for it and I don't I don't have to 
worry about, oh no, I'm out of everything. I can't wash my cloth diapers for a week because I'm waiting for detergent to come in. Like the convenience of cloth diapering is having all the cloth diapers here, all of my wipes here, all of my solution here, and all of my detergent here. So if I really did run out of detergent at the last minute, I could just send hubby to the store and get me some Tide because I need some <laughs> really fast. So that's my favorite detergent. I've also used Rock and Green and I can't really tell a difference between Tide and Rock and Green. Um, I can't, they don't smell any cleaner to me. They don't smell any better. Um, it worked, Rock and Green worked and it was perfectly fine, but it's just that Tide's cheap where you can use coupons and get it on good sale. So that's my favorite. So those are my favorite cloth diapering supplies and diapers and everything that goes along with it. And I'm sure that as baby boy grows and I have more children that that will change, but that's what it is for now. So I hope that that's helped you maybe make some decisions about what you're gonna buy or what you're doing, or if anything, it just entertained you for a little while. So give me a thumbs up for cloth diapers. You can subscribe for more cloth diapering videos. And thanks again for watching. Have a good day. Bye-bye.